Hey, third grade. Well, today is March 22nd, but since we were on spring break last week, we have a lot of days to catch up on. So this week, we're going to do a few days of calendar grid every day until we finally catch up on Friday. So today, we're going to look at March 14th, 15th, and 16th. So to start off on the 14th, we have... I'm going to zoom in a little bit more so you can see it. On the 14th, we have a table. And our time concept is weeks, as you can see here. It says number of weeks. So we are measuring time in weeks. And we don't need to do elapsed time since we're not looking at a clock. But you can go ahead and look at this table. It says weight of a newborn baby, number of weeks, and weight. So at week one, our baby weighs 372 kilograms, and then the weight increases from there on. All right, day 15, we have a clock. All right, our clock is a digital clock. Its time concept is hours and minutes and then we do need to look at a lapse time for this one so our last time recorded was 8 38 and now it's 8 52. so 38 to 48 is 10 minutes and then 48 to 52 is four minutes so that's 14 minutes that have passed so we're adding 14 minutes to our time up here so 27 plus 14 would be 41 minutes. So our elapsed time is 18 hours and 41 minutes. All right, and then for day 16, we have a wristwatch. And our wristwatch, the time is almost pointing to the 11 but it's not quite there yet so we're in 10 and it's at 10 52 so we're exactly two hours past our eight o'clock mark so we're on an analog clock our time concept again is hours and minutes and our clock is exactly two hours past 8:52. So that brings our new lapse time to 20 hours and 41 minutes. All right, I'll see you back here tomorrow for more Calendar Grid.